The irony is that I just released a video in which case I'm saying poetically, tie me up, tie me up. But uh, I didn't have this in mind. Dr. Martin, is this what our ancestors had to go through? Um, yes, it is. Uh, these are authentic uh, slave uh, chains. They were uh, minted, uh, founded uh, in the 1700s. Mm -hmm. Um, and I tell people that I can't see these as simply museum artifacts because they could very well have held my great, 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 whatever, grandmother or grandfather. Um, they are uh, extremely heavy and uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. um, and um, they, the, this part was um, a cuff, and so it went around the arms. But depending on the, um, the size of the child, this mm. could have been the neck. Um, mm. ring for, for a small child and of course this uh, being for um, an older teenager or adult uh, so um, a way of uh, punishing you um, and uh, these instruments were designed uh, as a means of control mm -hmm. so you see that it's it's heavy um, yes very and, and humiliating and very. Any, num any number of um, of emotions that you were um, supposed to feel psychologically because mm -hmm. one of the things that uh, was inherent in slavery was the idea of, of the psychology. Of right. It. And, and the thing that you guys can't see because you're not wearing this is that they're very heavy and I can't imagine like having to wear these for more than five minutes much less out in the hot sun in South Carolina or in Alabama or something exactly. like that. Exactly. Yeah. Did and they, the, uh, the, the length of the chain meant mm -hmm. that you um, could would wear that and you'd have to walk around. You could even be forced to do labor in, in those chains. Oh my so God. Um, it wasn't just a matter of yours putting the chains on and being held in place. Um, mm. uh, and the more other um, enslaved people saw you like that, the more you sent the message that the same thing could happen to you. And that was a part of the control of slavery. And you cannot imagine how uncomfortable and heavy these are. And to think that these are authentic, they are authentic. meaning that somebody actually used these exactly. and didn't have the luxury of saying, like I did, hey, loosen up a little bit. Exactly. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. awful. And how does this correlate to this young man who's crying? He's wearing a ball and chain with oh. a pretty uh, unfashionable outfit, I might add. Exactly. Um, the idea of the convict lease system when we talk about a second slave. And uh, so often uh, if um, parents were, uh, especially uh, black men, but black women as well, uh, penalized, put in jail, um, and uh, they had no choice but to take their children with them in, in some cases because there wasn't anyone to take care of, uh, of the child if they were in that. Um, position and the children often were uh, forced to uh, become, um, and their job was being the water boy and for the, um, for the other convicts. And anyone who knows anything at all about the, the convict system, and it, it was the convict lease system so that convicts, uh, uh, black men in, in particular, uh, uh, were stopped and given the choice of, uh, for, uh, and 99% and of the time, having committed no crime. Right. But given the choice of going to um, to jail or working on a, a person's farm. Mm. So it, it replaced the slavery that had, uh, had been abolished um, through the uh, 13th Amendment uh, with, uh, with this. Mm. Yeah, this is definitely... Uh an emotional challenge and a physical one and I can only feel the pain of those who had to wear these not just for a vlog but for life get it off <laughs>